from time to time, generation to generation. God has sent his servants, the prophets, for exhortation, edification and encouragement to his people. In the church today, Prophecy and Prophecy Confirmation, a program designed for you to follow prophecies and their confirmations with the prophet of our generation, the most profound prophet, known for his accuracy and prophecy, classic teachings and a deliverer of this generation. Prophet Shepherd Bush Heary, Major One. Stay tuned, and remain connected, to stay protected. During a Friday midweek service on 19th of June, 2015, Around 9.23 p.m. Central African time, and whilst giving prophecies to individuals, Prophet Shepherd Bush Heary spotted out a couple in the congregation for a prophetic word in their lives. He accurately and specifically mentioned to the couple that, there is a person who has gone to a witch doctor to get two charms, one, to make a lawyer be on his side, two, to make the wife die because, of a house. These were Prophet Shepherd Bushiri's exact words during the prophecy. I think today I must handle witchcraft so much. There's too much witchcraft happening. Mm -hmm. Stand up. Hey. Somebody has gone to Sangoma. Somebody has gone to Sangoma. Oh. Stand up. Someone has gone to Sangoma. Stop crying. Wait, there's a person who has gone to Sangoma to take two charms. One, to make a lawyer be his sight. Two, to make you die because of a house. It's true, it's true, it's true. If now we are not staying in that house, we are scared of those people. Huh? Even now, even we go home, we are not going to that house. We are scared for those people. In our house. Now. Now, men of God. They sent you a message, you. Yes, they said, We know you are you have gone for prayers. Yes, they said. But we'll deal with you. Yes, they told us. They said, they said I'm gonna die, but I'm gonna deliver me, please. Africa. Africa is dangerous. Their own property. It is your own property. Yes, our property. It's our property. We got the papers. They were and they have you. They were there for rent, like they were trying to be there, and now they are refusing to move out of the house. Yes, yes. Even they do not pay. And they even is saying you must pay them some seventy no, seven something US dollars. seventy something yes, dollars. Yes, dollars. They have even went to a lawyer and met a lawyer. Yes, yes. Be his of, side. Yes, it's your own true. house. Yes, man of God. Yes, that is. Major one, do something. Listen, that's why we have got the major prophets. Major prophets, they don't handle minor issues. We handle issues of our level. Now, let me do something. It will, it will go in your favor. Amen, amen. He further mentioned that these people sent a text message to the wife warning her that, they knew she has gone for prayers, therefore they will deal with her. In addition, the prophet stated that these people were renting this house but now they had connived with a lawyer to be on their side, so that they can possess the house. They sent you a message you. They said we know you are, you have gone for prayers. Yes, they said they we'll know. deal with you. Yes, they told us, they said, they said I'm gonna die but I'm gonna deliver me Notice the shock expression on the husband's face, after the prophet tells them about their problem. Two, to make you die, because of a house. Take note of how the woman bursts into crying, confirming that what the prophet was telling them was true. They said, we know you are, you have gone for prayers, but we will deal with you. Take note how the prophet accurately mentions about the lawyer, the house, the witch doctor, 
the text message. They have even went to a lawyer and met a lawyer. Yes, yes. Be his side. Yes. The cause of a house. Somebody has got a sign Stand up. They sent you a message. You. They said, we know you are you have gone for prayers. Later, Prophet Shepherd Bush Heri assured them, this case will be in their favor, in other words, telling them that, they will have their property back. These, were his words. Now let me do something. It will, it will go in your favor. Amen, amen. Now let me do something. It will, it will go in your favor. Amen, amen. One plus one, equals two. You can argue with one plus one, but you cannot argue with two, because two, is the answer. When a true prophet speaks, it surely comes to pass. Three weeks later, the couple came back to testify in church. They said, the prophet prayed for them and after only five days, they were able to get their house back. This was their testimony. We greet you in the, yes, we greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. We came to thank the God of Major Prophet Shepherd Bushiri for for the powerful and dangerous, for being so dangerous. Are Is you it? the one a prophet about the house? Yes, we are the one that they had taken our house, taken everything from us. You are the one? Yes. Uh, what happened? What was the prophecy? The prophecy, the prophecy was that the, those people that had taken the house who had bewitched us they took your house yes they had taken our house and you prayed for us and then within five days major we got our house back and i'm sorry but, but this thing this thing this thing is making me a bit emotional you see the professors they took your house for how long we had put those people to rent for two years, uh -huh. not knowing that they had con connived with the lawyer to, to forge the documents and take our property from us. And not knowing, the, you prophesied that the, the, the people have bewitched you and taken your property. And I it, mentioned the situation to you. Yes. There's a person who has gone to Sangoma to take two charms. One, to make a lawyer be his sight. <laughs> Two, to make you die. Because of a house. It's true. It's true. It's true. If you now are not staying at that house, you are scared of those people. You mentioned this. And situation. I said, when I pray for you, you're going to go every, back and get your property. Yes. And what happened? Within five days? Within five days, we got back our property. You have been struggling to get back for how long? So do I. Huh? One year. One year, Papa. Struggling to get back your yeah. property. One year. Huh? Yes, yes. for one year. For but one after year. prophecy, within five days. Yes. Now, let me tell you something. It will, it will go in your favor. Amen. It will, it will go in your favor. Amen. <laughs> The husband completely had no words to say about this miracle. What can we say, sir? I, I don't have words, my papa. I don't have words. I don't have words. Hold on. I want a miracle in your life to happen. A miracle which will make you to become speechless. are some miracles when they happen to you the only thing you will say is I don't have ways to say as if that was enough God continued to work more miracles in their lives on the same date of testimony prophet shepherd Bushiri prophesied again to this couple in the second prophecy around 4 37 p.m. Central African time he accurately mentions about 11 million being given to them as a compensation from the hospital, because the doctors removed the womb of the woman by mistake, and the couple, confirms this to be true. These, were his words. 
as I'm looking at you like this, just now, as I was standing here, God showed me something about her. Can I, can I tell you? Amen. Huh? Amen. Tell me, Papa. I'm seeing millions. Come, millions? Uh, wait. I wait. I see 11 million. Uh, I wait. Receive. This 11 million. Because in the spiritual realm, I don't know. I don't know. And I don't know anything about you. Amen. But in the spiritual realm, I'm seeing like they made a mistake at the hospital. Amen. They removed your womb. Or Amen. Something. It's two meters. It's two meters. And they are supposed to pay you. It's yes, two meters. Because they removed by accident. It's yes. two meters. It's two. I'm seeing that money. They'll pay you 11 million. Yes, I supposed to pay you they co they compensate they were supposed to compensate me but they keep on postponing and postponing they were not giving the money now major they said in august so we want you to seal it. this they must give us they are saying money. august yes yeah, they said august. when was the year they removed the womb it it was in 2000 and 2004 they didn't give you the money not that's yet that's why that's why to be 11 million Wait. Observe closely when the prophet mentions that they will give her the money. But the funny thing is that after he lays his hands on her, a new womb will appear. But but the funny thing is this: when I lay my hand upon her, a new womb will appear in her. We will see. Come again. Come on. Stop. Hold my hand. Take it. Take. Take it. It is done. Prophetic dance. A month later, during a Sunday service around 1.17 p.m. Central African time, the couple returned back for another testimony, this time the couple testifies that, after the prophet prayed for the wife, it did not take time before amazingly a new womb appeared. Listen very carefully to their testimony. Let's listen to the testimony. Hello church. My name is Lord Tispanda. I'm staying in Deben. We came here last month with my wife and the major prophet prophesied to us and he said he's giving my wife a womb. So I'm here, church, to tell you that. Uh -uh. Come again. What do you mean when you say I give your wife a womb? What happened to your wife? She had no womb. The doctors removed the womb by mistake. Huh? The doctors removed the womb by mistake. She had the cancer. Uh -huh. So when they operate, they made a mistake. They take their womb out. Or, uh, and a professor that the, the issue was in court. Yes, yes. The issue was in court, right? Yes, it is in court. She was in court trying to fight for compensation. Yes. And I prophesied. Yes. I, what did I say? Yeah, no, you said uh, they are going to give us the money. And uh, that money, they said, is August. Uh huh. Yes, so we're waiting for that money. It's August. But here I'm here. And I, I said as well, I said what? I said I'm going to pray for her. Yes, to, she will receive a new womb. A new womb? Yes. They didn't give you the money? Not that's yet. Why, that's why to be 11 million. Wait. But, but the funny thing is this. When I lay my hand upon her, a new womb will appear in her. 
who have, who have come here to thank God of Major. Now she had a new womb here. Show it on the screen. This testimony was so shocking that it was very difficult to believe just by the couple speaking. Hence, the church had to look for a highly specialist gynecologist to confirm if it is true she has a new womb. And this is what the gynecologist had to say. We had to get a gynecologist. A gynecologist. To confirm that what we are seeing is a womb. All right. Good afternoon, ECG family. My name is Esin Goveni. I'm a gynecologist. And I'm here to testify that uh, the womb is really dirty. Perfect. According to what I know and according to the script. <laughs> Woman, you're a millionaire. I receive. I re Papa, I just want to say thank you so much. I just want to say. I, I just want to say. I just want to say to your God. I, I could no words, Papa, really. I, I just want to say, Jehovah, I don't know to your God, Papa. Thank you so much, Papa. Surely the Lord God will do nothing, but he revealeth his secret unto his servants the prophets. Amos 3 verse 7. Imagine what would have happened to this couple if they had never met the prophet. 1. The house would have been taken by the tenant. 2. The woman would never conceive again. 3. They could have been killed. But because they met a true prophet, Prophet Shepherd Bushiri, Major One, the house they struggled to get for more than a year, only took five days. The womb which was mistakenly removed by the doctors appeared back by the word of a prophet. Lastly, they would not be alive today. Prophet Shepherd Bushiri, Major One, the prophet of our generation. From time to time. Generation to generation. God has sent his servants, the prophets, for exhortation, edification and encouragement to his people. In the church today, Prophecy and Prophecy Confirmation, a program designed for you to follow prophecies and their confirmations. With the prophet of our generation, the most profound prophet, known for his accuracy and prophecy, classic teachings and a deliverer of this generation. Prophet Shepherd Bushiri, Major One. Stay tuned, and remain connected, to stay protected.